So how do you integrate Stripe with ClickFunnels if you want to accept payments through your sales funnels and you're not just using funnels for collecting leads and selling over the phone, but you're actually selling something like here on the screen. For an example, we have the 37 funnels for $37. I also show you an example here with something more higher ticket where maybe you want to offer a payment plan. So make sure you stick to the end of the video to see how do you set up the products? How do you integrate Stripe? How do you create subscription products as well as order bumps? So with that said, let's dive into the video. First thing I'm going to do is go to account settings. And I'm actually gonna connect uh, this payment integration or gateway. Uh, you can see I have one right here. Default will add a new payment gateway. You can have up to nine uh, Stripe accounts. So I'm um, currently using one. We're gonna create a new Stripe account. Uh, we're gonna call it Freedom Funnels. And if you wanna enable Apple Pay, you can do that as well. Uh, but what I'll do is just um, I'm not gonna make it default. I would if I only have one, which most people just have one. I'm gonna create the account and then I'm gonna connect it with Stripe. And what's good about Stripe is if you're logged into Stripe, um, it'll automatically ask you if you wanna authorize it. But what, what we'll do right now is uh, create a new account. So I'm just gonna put my password there. Boom. And now they're gonna ask for a verification from my phone. I'm then gonna copy this code. So then you fill out all of that information about the business and your personal details. So this is why it's important that you actually put all your details in here because now we're gonna ask them just going through this real quick i'm not adding the real information and so it's saying you're missing the bank account and all that so let's just put that right now boom we're gonna hit save and hopefully that should be it now we're gonna review yes Agree. Returning to Click Funnels will be redirected in just a second. And boom, there we go. So they recently updated this. It looks like a new update that they did for 2021, but now we have that added. Now what we can do is we go into a funnel. Let's say that this is the funnel where you want to create a product. Uh, you go to settings and you want to choose the Stripe account, especially if you have two. So I'm just going to choose Freedom Funnels. I'm not going to hit save because this is a live funnel. Um, but I would, you know, choose the Stripe account there and hit save. I would then go back to steps and I would go to, I would make sure that I'm in the step order form so I can see the products here. The reason I'm showing you this as well is because it's another example of how you can structure a funnel where you have first a sales page and then the order form on the, the next page. So here we would then have the product. There's no products here on the sales page. Obviously there's just the order form page. And so we're going to go there and we're going to go to products and want to take a look at the subscription there uh, or payment plan. Sorry. Uh, what you would do here is you would go to products. And I'll just show you this real quick because we have two different products. We have one that's the main product uh, and then we have a order bump, which is a bonus upsell, a quick upsell if people want to purchase that as well. So $37 for the main product. We have $17 for the order bump. And I can just, to show you guys, I'll just add a new product here. So we're gonna choose this one. I'm gonna choose the type of payment. So is it a subscription payment plan or one time? It's a one time payment. I'm gonna hit save and next. Go to product details. So what I like to add here is if I'm selling something that has multiple different products in it, I like to put that so like, template bundle plus tutorials so when people pay they see like oh i'm getting this so with a course for example i put the course plus bonuses or course plus coaching calls so you, you know what i mean so it's uh, if it's e-commerce obviously you would put exactly what they're getting uh product price we're gonna put 37 us dollars uh, uh, i'm gonna scroll down i don't have to fill this out uh billing description you want to put here um freedom funnels i'll just put bundle 
uh, product description. And then this is where, if it's an order bump, and I'll show you here an example, I have expert secrets up here. This is where, you know, I put my information there. I want to buy this. This is an order bump where I fill it out and I say, yes, I want to buy this. So then it's not there as a main offer. It's just if you want to add it to your cart. So if the product is an order bump, you would then click this right here and it would create it as an order bump, meaning it's not on the order form. It's not visible. People can't click it there. It's just an addition if they already buy the other one. So just wanted to clarify that. And then we would go, but it's not, this one is not. So we would hit save and um, go to the next one. Product variations, if you wanna have sizes, stuff like that, I don't wanna have that. Um, save, so there's two more things I wanna do. Send out an email and also integrate them to the membership where they can download it. So membership integration, yes, I would then choose my existing integration. So I'm using Kajabi, I would choose that, select the offer, and then you again hit save and next and then fulfillment email yes and i would say confirmation blah blah and here i just send them a welcome message like hey congrats on your purchase welcome to freedom funnels my name is blah 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 here's the next steps and also if you have questions here's our support email okay and uh, yeah that's pretty much it that's what i do if you have an e-commerce product you want to use shipping if you want to have and if you're using the, the ClickFunnels email follow-up funnels here, you can obviously set those follow-up actions here, uh, but it's not a physical product. I'm using active campaign for my emails. So I'm just gonna hit save and close and the product is live. Now, what for an example, and actually let me remove that so people can't see it there. I'm just gonna remove the product. Um, you saw me add an order bump. So the last thing we'll do is we're gonna go here and you're gonna see how I set up a payment plan. So I would go to add product. I'm gonna choose my Stripe account. I'm gonna set up a payment plan, right? And the only difference between a subscription and a payment plan is you set up the product in Stripe, okay? But then, um, let me go here. I'll just put course, pay, plan. Um, I'm gonna go down here. I can then choose a Stripe plan. So three pay plan, full time funnel design a course 2021 and that uh, number of plans three okay because the subscription inside of stripe uh i'm telling click funnels and stripe actually how many payments you know it's supposed to be so it's not an ongoing thing after three payments cancel it that's pretty much what i'm doing and so then i would do the same thing membership fulfillment email all of that i would save it and i would then have it um inside of that order form so now when people go to enroll they can see the offer. They can choose between all those products that we have here, um, meaning the full price or payment plan. So, so then lastly, let's go to Stripe and show you how to create this product. So you don't have to create the product if it is uh, a one-time payment, but let's say that it is a payment plan. What you can do is you'll add a product here. So we're gonna call this course pay plan description, uh, you know, des describe the course or the product that you're selling. I'm gonna choose a standing pricing and I'm gonna choose US dollar and 295 and then recurring. Monthly, yes, we don't wanna charge them weekly. And then that's pretty much it. I'll save the product. And now when I go into the funnel, I can then go here and find that subscription just like I showed you with the Freedom uh, Full-Time Funnel Designer payment plan. 2021 and that's where i put if it's a subscription i just leave it there as a subscription it's going to charge them per month and i manually go in and cancel if people cancel you could do that for memberships but for a payment plan i would use this product inside of click funnels and um, set it to three payments and so that's pretty much it that's how you integrate stripe with click funnels hopefully you like this video make sure you smash that like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already because we post videos like this daily and uh, yeah, if you want to check out some of our products or the free community, free trainings, we have those links in the description as well. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace.